Good afternoon, visitors. The vessel that you see departing through the Duluth Ship Canal is the Masabi Miner. The Masabi Miner was built in 1977 by the American Shipbuilding Company in Lorain, Ohio. She measures 1,004 feet in length, 105 feet in width, and 56 feet in depth. That one long and two short whistle exchange that you just heard between the ship and the lift bridge operators, the captain salute. The Masabi Miner is powered by two 8,000 horsepower, 16 cylinder peel stick diesel engines, which give her a top speed of 15 knots or about 17 miles an hour. She's also equipped with a 1,500 horsepower bow thruster to aid her maneuverability in port. The Masabi Miner has 36 hatches on her deck, which open into seven cargo holds located below deck. These cargo holds give her a maximum carrying capacity of 63,300 tons. Above her deck is a 265-foot self-unloading boom, which allows her to unload her own cargo at a rate of 10,000 tons per hour for coal without the aid of shoreside equipment. The Masabi Miner is currently owned and operated by the Interlake Steamship Company of Middleburg Heights, Ohio, and she's departing with about 68,000 tons of western coal that she'll be taking to uh, Detroit or Monroe, Michigan for the power plants over there, the Detroit Edison power plants. Once again, this is the Masabi Miner, built in 1977, measures 1,004 feet in length. She's one of 13 1,000 foot or longer vessels currently operating on the Great Lakes. And she is on her way to the Detroit area with a load of western coal for their power plants. <laughs> Crew on deck, make sure to give them a good wave and wish them safe travels.